Hey guys, it's Cecilia. Welcome. Wait, should I take off my glasses? Glasses off or on? I can't see. But it's just going to be a glare. That's okay though. Y'all can deal with it. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Cecilia. Welcome to another video. I'm filming this today. I'm uploading it and I was lazy and I couldn't come up with a video idea. So I'm doing a good old fashioned Q&A today. But while I answer y'all's questions, I'm going to be working on one of my art projects for school. I started this during the winter time. I kind of got bored of it. I want to start something new. So I started something new and I'm just working on this whenever I have free time. So I'm just going to be watercoloring this while I answer your questions. I don't know what else to say, so I guess I will just start with a question and hopefully I can do this at the same time. The first question is, are you single? Exclamation point, question mark. Yes, but I really like someone right now. So yeah, I won't go into detail, but... I like someone, but I am single, but I like someone, so, yeah. <laughs> okay, next question is, would you ever get a playlist or a YouTube event? Okay, so I have always wanted to go to one, just, um, just like meet other YouTubers that I love or watch. So I'm hoping one day that I can, I think it would be super fun. I would definitely vlog it for you guys so you can watch it but maybe like in a few years i will be able to go to like one in florida or something i don't know but i do think that would be super fun the next question is what are your post high school plans this is so hard i don't know if i can color and do this at the same time my plans after high school i definitely want to go to college and i have been going on a couple college visits and tours i definitely want to stay in my state of North Carolina. I want to be close to home, close to my little brother who's going to be starting kindergarten whenever I start college, which is insane. And it's going to be really sad for me because I'm going to miss a lot of that. But I want to stay in the state so I can like come visit all the time and see him and my sister. But I've toured UNC Greensboro, UNCG. Yesterday I went to UNC Charlotte and I really like that. Next week I'm going to UNC Asheville. I love Asheville. I went there for my birthday so if you guys want to see that video it'll be in the information card on one of these sites. And I'm going to be touring Appalachian State University. As far as like a major goes, I have gone back and forth with different stuff. I am interested in art because I'm very artsy. Love art. Always taken art classes in high school, elementary, middle school. I also am interested in elementary education. I'm in love with kids and I'm always hanging out with kids, like little kids in my neighborhood. And I love like teaching, I guess. Even though I'm like, I, don't, I mean, it's not like I've had experience teaching, but like when I'm with my brother and we're like, okay, here's an example. The other day I was taking a walk with my little brother in at like seven or eight and the moon was out and I was teaching him all about the moon and the solar system. And we came back and I made up like two different crafts for us to do about the solar system. Hold on, I'll show you guys. They're so cute. I don't have his, um, cause I don't know where he put them, but we did like little watercolor planets and then like a little solar system. I don't know. So I also thought about education. I've also thought about psychology. I'm super interested in like psychology and learning about the brain and why people think certain things, but I'm really interested in like different disorders like um, dissociative identity disorder or OCD, which is something I have or like schizophrenia. I read a book. We had a choice novel book report for school and I chose a book about a boy that had schizophrenia. So I'm really interested in that. I'm taking AP Psychology next year, my senior year. When I went to UNC Charlotte yesterday, I talked to one of the art teachers and they do have an art education program. So I'm thinking about doing that. You get first hand experience in a classroom your first semester so I thought that was really really cool now I'm kind of leaning towards art education as a major and psychology as a minor so 
we'll see what happens but that's my post high school plans i hope that was enough information i think it was i talked a lot about that all right next question is how do you make your videos i don't think i've ever really talked about this and this could be a separate video actually so i'll just give you a little overview so i film my videos on my canon g7x camera i love it that's what most youtubers will vlog with um usually not sit down videos like this but i'm fine with this i am not spending any more money on it i edit my videos on my macbook so if you have a mac you have um iMovie on your mac for free so i usually use that i want to use final cut pro but it's really expensive and iMovie is working okay for right now so um maybe in the future i will upgrade but um if you don't have like a mac or something and you have an iphone they have iMovie on there i've never used it i know there's different um editing apps that you can use and i just kind of figured it out myself and also watching YouTube videos about how to edit and stuff. If you have more questions about that, then I can just film a different video about how I do all my YouTube videos. Next question is, is Billie Eilish a good singer? Yes, duh. Billie Eilish is the, she's a queen, okay? She's a queen. I don't care what people's opinions are about her. I love her. She's a hard worker. She's freaking 17 years old and she's done so much and i'm waiting for her new album to come out but the person that asked that question i know him and i got him into billy eilish but if you've never heard of billy eilish you need to go listen to her music she's amazing and i have a big fat girl crush on her so yep billy eilish is the best ever are raccoons bulletproof um i had to look this one up my answer before i looked it up was no because I don't know why they would be bulletproof, but looked it up. They're not bulletproof, but I don't know if this has to do with it, but there's another animal that might be bulletproof and that's an armadillo. So two years ago in 2017, some guy, I don't really remember who he was. Some guy tried to shoot an armadillo and the bullet hit um, the armadillo's, how hit the hard shell and bounced back and shot him. I don't know if he died or whatever, but um armadillos might be bulletproof if you hit them on the shelf so here's your fun fact of the day from cecilia what do you want to do this summer so this summer i'm gonna be working this summer um i'm gonna be nannying again i did that last summer but this summer is gonna be it for a different family i did do a day in the life of a nanny last summer so if you want to see that video i'll have it in the information card it's really cute but i was really cringy i'm gonna be nannying pretty much every day um my sister might do some some days for me for two little girls that i love this summer i really want to do more things and go experience new things go see new things either by myself or with friends but i want to not really travel because i don't want to like you don't have the money for that but traveling meaning like maybe a little road trip to somewhere or go hiking or something i don't know i just want to do more fun things and not be shut up in my room yeah i don't really have anything in particular i want it to be more spontaneous and just like see what kind of happens and i I don't know i just want it to be a really fun summer the next one says this isn't a question but you're so pretty and i love you you all are so sweet thank you so much i think i've seen you in the middle school because i'm a teacher's assistant at my school for the middle school teachers so i've seen you around and you are gorgeous and i love you too and the last one is from one of my good friends she said how can you be so cute and so pretty all the time that is all you girl gosh i look so pale that's another thing i should do this summer is be outside and get a tan because you know that would be fun but i love you zoe and that is all the questions i had so thank you guys so much for watching and thank you to everyone who asked me a question y'all need to let me know what you want to see because i'm running out of ideas and i need some ideas so yeah you can give this video a thumbs up to help me out if you liked it or even if you didn't like it you can give it a thumbs up 
because we don't need any negativity. No thumbs down, no mean comments. And also, go watch my last video. I went to the beach for a weekend with two of my best friends and I had such a fun time and I keep watching the video so y'all should definitely go check that out. You can subscribe to my channel if you want to. I hope you all had a great St. Patrick's Day. If you celebrate it, even if you don't, I hope you had a great day. Go spread some happiness and smile and be happy. And ew, that was so cringy. I'll see you guys in the next video on Sunday. Bye guys. Ew. I'll see you guys. And I'll see you guys in the next video on Sunday. Bye. Ew. And I'll see you guys in the next video on Sunday. Bye. Sunshine, I'm watching through the window.